Good morning, Hot Tots, and welcome back to my channel. My name is Sophie, if you're new here, hi. I know I look crazy right now because I just put self-tanner on. I have my pants tucked into my shirt. We're looking great. Um, good morning. So I decided on a whim to film today because I realized I have no video for tomorrow. <laughs> so I'm gonna film my Q&A today. Either that'll go up Monday or this will go up Monday and then I'll um, have my Q&A go up Thursday a second portion um but yeah i put myself tanner all the way to my chin and not on my face at all and i'm just letting it sit i am the palest i've literally ever been in my entire life to the point where i'm like what's going on <laughs> my skin pigmentation is usually a little more olive toned and this year i really got to an all-time low so that's just a little about me <laughs> Anyways, it's 11.51, all I had today was coffee and I'll show you what I had. Um, all I have is the Starbucks cold brew and then I had one serving of my Italian sweet cream, which if you're not new here, you know, you guys, I do not count my first cup of coffee as points. Um, so that's what I had and then for lunch, I'm about to just make some lunch uh, because I didn't really have any breakfast as you guys know. and. I found these home chef meals at my Kroger and I thought that was so cool. But I thought it was so cool so you could just buy them pre-made and it says on the back per serving how many calories and per container. So this is 360 calories for the whole container. I'm gonna eat the whole thing. This is the Sunday beef. Oh my gosh, it's Sunday. Stop. This is the Sunday beef pot roast with roasted vegetables. And it's 360 calories again for the whole thing. So I'm just gonna heat this up and eat this for lunch and see how we like it. It's gonna be seven points for the whole meal. So let's heat this up, shall we? So we'll start that, but this is the meal. I've never seen this at my store before, so it must be new, but you can also buy the Home Chef meals in my Kroger, like the full ones that you can cook at home by yourself. And I thought that was pretty cool. So. I bought this and a chicken fajita one, and I wanna try this out for lunch. So we're gonna heat that up, probably add some salt and pepper, maybe a little sauce, I don't know. We'll have to see how it tastes um, and go from there. But let's try it guys, we'll see. Okay, here it is, seven points, and it looks really good. So I'm gonna try it really quick for you guys and let you know how it is. I don't know if you have this at your store, um, being able to eat home chef meals or buy them, but I'm excited to try it. I look so crazy today. <gasps> you guys are used to it by now. Okay, let's try some of the meat. Really good. Potato and carrot. This is really good. This is such a good alternative to like an actual frozen meal. It's like they're fresh at my Kroger. So I was scanning in a bunch of them and the fajita one, it doesn't have much in it, but it's actually 12 points probably because of the rice. Um, but it's just nice to have like a home cooked tasting meal really quickly. So this is 10 out of 10 for me. This is really good. I'm going to probably add just like a little bit of ketchup, which you guys know I don't count. And then a little more salt and pepper and we're good to go. Mmm, I love pot roast. Also, I did want to tell you guys, I'm gonna have a lot of sponsored content coming up and I just want you to bear with me, okay? It's all stuff that we'll like, but I got offered to do like a food service one, which you guys will see um, my Yvette Sportswear as per usual. And then um, Cupshe, I'm working with Cupshe. Um, I'm going on vacation, you know, so they're sending bathing suits and stuff and you know, they're very size inclusive and stuff like that. So just wanted to give you a heads up that I will be doing some sponsored content within these next couple weeks and I'm really excited about it. And I'll look a little better in those. <sighs> right, when I eat this, I'm hopefully next time I see you, I'll look a little better. <laughs> So for a small dessert, I'm just gonna have one of these Reese's peanut butter hearts. I bought these for my friend for her birthday. I just put a couple in her bag. Um, I like these for like a small lunch dessert when I just want a little bit of chocolate to hold me over. So having one of these, it's gonna be delish. Guys, I also just wanted you to know that like last week I was 6.6 .6 
on that Sunday. And then today I was 3.4. Um, I have to redo my calendar and that, and so I, okay, we obviously know this is probably some water weight too for my period, but as you can see, I just fluctuated up and down, up and down, up and down, up and down. Um, and then finally the lowest. So I'm really excited, that, but whatever. I'm just so excited that it's lower. We're making movement. We're making progress. I did Orange Theory four times this past week. I'm doing it five times next week. I'm just excited to be kicking butt. Now I got to erase this all and make a February calendar. Well, I got dressed with nowhere to go. So that's fun. Also, I got a couple new additions. First of all, I made my bed. I know it'd be so proud of me, but I got a couple new additions. I got this little soap dispenser from Target and this little holder from Target. I just think it goes with my aesthetic, super cute. And then I got a new toothbrush, guys. This cleans your toothbrush every time you put it down in here. We'll see how it goes. Okay, I'm not gonna lie, guys. I just want a pretty basic next meal. And these are my go-tos when I'm not feeling like really cooking something. So I'm having six of the Kid Fresh Chicken Nuggets for three points, and then five points worth of the Orida French Fries, which is about three ounces of the French Fries. So I have those in the air fryer cooking up, and I'm gonna have that as my next meal. I'll probably have another meal after this because it's 5.34 and this is my second meal. So I still have a lot of points left and we're gonna, you know, work with those points, guys. But this is what I do when I don't wanna cook and when I'm like craving fast food. So I might even put some cheese on this, we'll see. I also just got some stuff in the mail, some Yvette sportswear outfits that I'll be showing you guys in a different video. And then I bought from Beauty Counter the um, Melting Body Balm. I love this stuff. And my skin has just been so dehydrated, which I know so many people as always is during winter. So I got that. And then the Luminous Hydration Body Oil. I'll link it down below for you guys. But I need all of the hydration I can get right now. It's literally out of control. This bottle, I love these bottles super heavy duty. So pretty. It's like a mauve purplish color. I love it. So I got these two to help hydrate the crap out of my body. Okay. I love them. They're so pretty. Okay. I'm really excited. I added one point's worth of Tostitos queso blanco and some jalapenos on top of my French fries. I got these sliced tamed jalapeno peppers because I don't like them too spicy. Oh. But this is gonna be amazing. The cheese sauce. Everything I dream of. Mm hmm. I love it. So I'm gonna eat this and drink my third water. Um, my water tastes so bad right now. So I'm drinking bottled water. Yes, I do recycle. Okay. But I literally cannot even put the water that we have right now in my. Uh, recipes because I put it in uh, my chili last week and it tasted so bad because of the water. So I don't know what's going on with the water situation, but we're drinking bottled water for now. And I do recycle my water bottles because we have recycling here at my apartment complex, which is really nice because they literally just come do it themselves. But anyways, I'm going to eat this up and then I'll be back for the next meal. I have seven points left. So definitely enough points to play with for a second dinner or a big dessert, second dinner and a small dessert. All right, guys, I'm having a bomb pop. These are only two points and they truly are only two points. I'm not changing the points on them. So I'm gonna have one of these. Popsicles. It really helped to like sit, watch a show and keep your mouth busy basically so that you're not like wanting to eat a ton because a lot of times I feel like when I watch TV, I'm not hungry, I just want a snack, you know? And like popsicles really help me with that. I love bomb pops. Cheer. Oh, okay, I'm having two pieces of the Sara Lee's 45 calorie bread, it's a point a piece. And then I used one tablespoon of the natural drip. It's so like watery. Um, so it definitely made it over the two pieces, but if you look, it's just super watery, but 
whatever, this is gonna be the end of my points. Still good. I'm actually really full right now. Today's eating wasn't like the best, most perfect. Um, I usually try to eat a little more whole foods lately, especially during the day. Like I, I haven't had like just chicken nuggets and fries in so long, as you guys have known on my channel. Like I, I used to have that all the time. I haven't had that just as my meal in so long, but some days, you know, you just don't feel like cooking and you don't feel like having salad or a bunch of veggies and stuff like that. And today was one of those days I just wasn't feeling it. Um, and so I just had all those foods that just make me happy and that make me not binge, you know what I mean? Like peanut butter toast also is so freaking good. I forgot, I forgot. But you know, some days you just need to have chicken nuggets and French fries and you can still stay within your points and just eat them at home in an air fryer. And it's amazing because it just helps you to not go binge but I just want to always show you guys the truth you know and some days are like this where I eat like I am a five-year-old and it's okay you know and you know most days like I have the dill pickle salad kit that I was gonna eat that for lunch today but I just wasn't feeling it and I'm like no I'll eat that for lunch tomorrow you know it's it's fine you don't always have to eat so great and so perfect and I have been eating like so many more whole foods and cooking more at home and doing a lot better. Cause you know, that's one of my things is like making more recipes, eating more whole foods. But this weekend I did not end up like resetting like I usually do. I didn't go to the grocery store. I didn't do all these things. And so I also just didn't feel like cooking and it's okay, you know? So I just wanna show you guys obviously what I'm truly eating, but also that like no one is perfect, but you can still stay within your points and still lose weight and still have days like this, you know, and it's okay. Tomorrow I'm going to have a big salad for lunch and I'm thinking about making um, a new recipe tomorrow night to see if it works out good. And then I'll show you guys. Um, but yeah, I just wanted to say, I know today was a five-year-old's eating day and I'm happy about it because I'm satiated. I don't feel like binging anything. You know, I feel great. So thank you guys so, so much for watching as always. If you loved this video or even if you just liked it, please give it a thumbs up. <laughs> Subscribe if you haven't because it really helps support my channel. I post every Monday and Thursday. I love you guys so much and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.